What is up guys, Limo here, and I'm tired of seeing guys sucking at this, okay? What I mean by this is meeting girls during daytime, okay? Like, it's so easy, you know? You're just meeting girls, it's a girl, bro. Like, go talk to her. Like, stop, being, stop being a cunt. Stop listening to your feelings, okay? Fuck your feelings, all right? One of the keys to being successful with women is being aware of that. Your feelings aren't on your side, all right? Your ego doesn't want you to win. Your feelings doesn't want you to win. We have a reptilian brain that wants to make us survive and be safe. So if you're gonna listen to him, it's gonna put you in your comfort zone and you're not gonna grow. So one of the keys for me, honestly, and for everybody that works with me is, you know, you have to fuck your feelings and you have to, you have to go, put yourself out there, humiliate yourself, okay? Embarrass yourself, fuck being successful. Fail, fail more, because the more you fail, the more you learn. I know it's, it seems cheesy, but that, that's how it works. And it starts by yourself, you know, there's not a technique or a fucking gimmick that's gonna help you with this. It starts by yourself, and once you have, once yourself, you know that you can uh, handle this kind of humiliation, those rejections, those embarrassments, that's when you can freely put yourself out there and freely experience the world. Because if you're in your cocoon of comfort and you're not taking action, I've, I've been to so many boot camps with guys and I tell them, you know, go, go approach this girl, go do this, go do that. And you know, they keep, they keep watching me. They, they keep watching me doing it and they don't do it themselves till I take them literally by the hand and show them how to do it by the hand on a fucking set. So, you know, it's, it's crazy, man. It comes down to action. and. If you want to get successful in life, it's not, it's not going to come, you know, miraculously. You know, the stars aren't going to align gracefully for you to be successful. You're going to need to take action and embarrass yourself. And what I would like to to take out of this video is allow yourself to fail. Okay, most guys have, you know, <coughs> you know, they have high expectations of how an interaction should go. They want to make it work. And the thing is, if you need it to work, it's never going to work. Okay. I repeat, if you need it to work, it's never gonna work, all right? So, you know, be present and allow yourself to fail. And once you'll be in that, uh, you know, in that present state of allowing yourself to, you know, be in the moment like this and talk to a woman and just, you know, allow yourself to be present. Don't make it, don't try to make it work but actually just put yourself out there because every approach is a win. Every approach is a victory. Once you have that mindset that whatever you do, whatever how it goes, like if it, if it fails or if it succeeds, you are successful because you just went for it, okay? Let's say you have a handicapped child, okay? And you have another child that is not handicapped, okay? Would you love them both equally? Yes or no, okay? It's like an approach, okay? Maybe you have a bad approach, maybe you suck, okay? You, you, you've been like a pussy and you, you didn't know what to say. And on the other hand, you have another approach and you've been, you know, super men to women, super in the moment, everything was good. You have to love them both equally, okay? You have to love both of them equally because it's you, it's, it's what you've done, you've went for it. So give yourself props, okay? Most guys wouldn't do it. Most guys, they need alcohol, they need to numb themselves to do this. But you're going for it, okay? If you're going for it, that's what matters the most. It's taking action, one more set, one more set, one more repetition, one more piece of productivity, okay? Always, one more piece of productivity. What can I do more? How can I do, like, how, how can I maximize my time, okay? If you don't value your time, you don't value your life, okay? View yourself like this, view your time as valuable. Stop wasting time, you know, wasting time fumbling around in the street and just watching girls pass by, watching opportunities pass by.